Hey, do you believe raw oysters are healthy? Well, I can't say I've heard of one complaining that it was sick. I, I have painted my swing. Now grab your destiny. If you know what I mean. Wait a minute, Link. Don't leave the cave with do you think you're going. This is a great chance to bundle. Screw the man, you know it. Critics said that the D was done. The sun had set. Okay, I'm gonna go eat with this. I'll be right back. But one thing they never thought about is that the tea would rise again. No. All right. First up, we have Sly Cooper. Group. 
I just got back from TagFest and probably from the uh, clips you're going to see, it's probably just going to be Brett digging around with his guitar. But let me tell you, when it's one hell of a con, it was really fun. I was supposed to DJ, but we couldn't get the sound system to work properly, so I couldn't do much DJing. But the staff was beyond nice. I, I can't even describe it. They are fucking amazing. Love you guys. Love you guys. <laughs> Anywho, let's get to the point of this this part of the video anyway. I bought shit. <laughs> so, here we have Sonic and Knuckles for Sega Genesis. As you can see, you can open the top part here. And if you're not familiar with Sonic and Knuckles, uh, Sonic 3 and Sonic Knuckles were supposed to be... I said Sonic Knuckles. Anyway, the, Sonic 3 and Sonic and Knuckles were supposed to be one game, but due to time constraints or something... They split them into two games, so they released Sonic 3 first, and then they released this, and if you put Sonic 3 into here, you could play it as one full game. And if you put Sonic 2 in here, you could play Sonic 2 as Knuckles, which is fucking awesome, in my opinion. That's This is going to be a nostalgia trip for me, <laughs> so I bought that. Uh, this is a ROM hack. I don't know of what game... But I tested it out on this guy. He had a this guy had a portable Super Nintendo, and he had a converter thing where if you put it in the top, you and uh, you put a Genesis cartridge in the connector on top, you could play Genesis games in this portable Super Nintendo. So it was really cool. But um, <laughs> here's a ROM hack. It's called Metal Sonic Hyperdrive Loon Devil. It's made by Loon Devil. Lone Devil. Okay. It's really hard to read that, but um, yeah, it was only 20 bucks, and I tested it out. It was really fun, so there's that. I'm going to play that, and this is going way back for me. Mortal Kombat 3 for Sega Genesis, the first Mortal Kombat game I've ever played. I've been playing Mortal Kombat since I was three years old. I got to say, the, honestly, out of all of the games that I've bought for my Sega Genesis... This one has the most value to me, again, because I grew up with it. It's one of my favorite games ever. I probably can't beat it now, because for whatever reason, games like this get harder the older you get, but 
I guess it's because you lose muscle memory. But, still, this is one of my favorite games of all time. If you haven't played it, what the fuck is your problem? Seriously, play it. It's fucking... I just... Ugh. I can't give you a straight answer without nostalgia tripping! Anywho. <laughs> oh, hey, Jacob. What's up? Um, I just put the world scroll up. And it, over, and it overlapped to, like, the world the world map and, uh, and the fairy tale. What's your plan? It's, it's good. You want to come see it? Yeah, I will in a minute. I'm doing an overview on the games we uh, bought. Yeah. I know what I'm playing tonight. So this is Uncharted Drake's F Fortune. We've played Uncharted 3 uh, when we got our PlayStation. And we never played any of the other Uncharted games, but that's going to change. Because this is the first one, right? Drake's Fortune? Yeah. All right. And the second one is Honor Among the... Wait. No, that's... That's like Cooper's second head, dang it. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. So... Yeah, we got Uncharted. Again, I have no idea what this game is. I it's obviously it's, it's a Uncharted. It's really a treasure hunt hunting game and good adventure. It's a good action. And it's a, it's a great way to see where the series got its start. It's naughty. Well, yeah, Naughty Dog. The same people who gave you Jack and Dad. Well, no shit. Sir. Like I said, it's a, it's good to see where the where the series started. And over here we have Borderlands Two. We bought Borderlands 1. I still haven't beaten it. Have you beaten it yet? No, not yet. I've, I have not touched the game because I want to, because I want to finish Black Flag and all the other so, stuff. So, the only thing I know about this game is that it's fun. And that's where the whole, the coming out of the wall sphincters <laughs> thing came from. They're coming out of the wall sphincters! But yeah, this is just an overview of the shit that I got at Tagfest. Um, yeah? Jacob, help me end a video! <laughs> is this funny to anybody? Also, just adding this at the end of the video because I told Jacob I would. Woo! That's a Berserk wall scroll, Jacob. Check out if you haven't seen Berserk, watch it. It's, it's really it's a it's a classic. We were not paid for that advertisement, but I wish we were.